You want me to put some of that stuff, Mama? Yes. We're making some tiropitake with phyllo pastry, folks. For those who don't want to make their own dough or phyllo, which you can. Yeah, you can do but it. But this is and easier too yeah, for those. Very easy. And what do I put in the mixture here? What did you put in here? Just egg and cheese? Egg and cheese, that's it. Nothing Spe else. Special cheese? Special feta. Has to be feta? Yeah. Mom. Oh, it doesn't matter. Any, any cheese you like, it doesn't matter. bigger if you like in it too. Mama, what's this? What's that? Uh, spinach. From your garden. From my garden? Yeah, spinach and uh, silver wheat mix. Yeah. And some egg. That's it. If you can, we Cook can. it a bit? You cook yeah, of it? course, yeah. Saute it a little bit, yeah? Yeah. yeah. So we're making this duro pitakia and spinach pitakia. Yeah. Pitas. yeah. And in the background here, we're actually boiling up some sugar and water. Do you want me to put some honey in there? Yeah, of course. I'm not put it. No, I'm you didn't sorry. put it. Yeah, you have to put it in hand too. My hands are slippery. Uh, is enough the honey there? Hellenic gift, organic, and special reserve. Yeah, there's enough. Enough? You yeah. have to put oh. I got oh, a that's honey, look, that's your honey. <laughs> that's your honey. Put them in the water. Which if you one? keep it outside, keep it in the water. Yeah. Just a little bit of water under. Yeah. Not the ants, well, <laughs> because if you, the ants smell like honey or sugar, it's full okay. up. If you put them a little bit in, in the in bottom the, of the water, keep them in, in, the, the, in a bowl of water so they yeah. can't get over. Yeah. Okay. You see? Doesn't matter, no, but I don't know how to come from this ants. We're putting some of this. Is enough there? The same honey. Yeah, about here. four tablespoons. That's enough. Now, while we're boiling this syrup here, yeah. is we're making tukutayu, which is a dessert spoon. Yeah. But what are we using as the fruit? fruit uh, watermelon. Watermelon, hey. That's it. Have you ever used watermelon as a dessert? I know you eat it as a fruit. So what we've done here, That's the is we've basically kept the outer skin, yeah. the pith itself, yeah. take the skin off and just slice it into little bite sizes like that. Leave that's a little it. bit of the flesh inside because that's where you get the extra sweetness and flavour from it too. So they're all just cut up into just jagged pieces, shapes and sizes, nothing special like that. You can see we started slicing that width and just dice them into angular pieces and cut the outer skin off, the green part off, which is a little bit tough. Then we're going to add that into the syrup to soften. And once it cools down, it's ready. Basically eat it. I'm going to drop it back in now. Mama, hey, I love you. I love you too. Mm, what happened? I love you more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's enough. That's, is that enough? Yeah. Like that. Fold it over. These are trigona. Trigona, yeah. When I went to Greece, I saw them making trigona like this. Now they have a different shape and size. You can actually cut them narrower. These are yeah. quite large, but you can make the base a little bit more narrow. Like that. One the second. Trigona, there, that's you put a little bit of butter on the end. In the Thessaloniki. Yeah, I know. Yeah, where they make them, the famous trigona. Dessert. Done. Another one. <laughs> what's, what's going on? And I'll open the top, the, <laughs> the leaves. I'll try putting this here. I have to put them to the watermelon there. Put it in there now? Yeah. So what we've got in there is two and a half cups of sugar with two and a half cups of water and about four tablespoons of Helene Gift pure honey. Which one did I use? I use this one here. Yeah. This is the uh, organic fir tree honey. So put that in there too? Yeah. Does it need a little bit more water? It's not covered properly, Mum. Let's see. What happened? Needs more? It comes off, then it comes off a bit. Okay, we'll shrink. Yeah. Done. All right, back to the tiropitakia. Yes. <laughs> you, no, oh, oh. <laughs> kill your wife now. <laughs> Ready? Oh, look at yeah. them. <laughs> <laughs> Huge. Yeah. They're delicious. All right, put them down here. I've got to eat one. Put them down. You're going to make it a little, you're going to turn into a little fatty boomba. Yeah. <laughs> it's hot. bad myself. Here. Oh, oh that nice. one there. Oh, that's careful, really soft. Careful, careful. My mind's stuck. I need a, I need a spatula. Yeah, I'm second. I'll bring it to you. It's okay. It's okay. You right? This is the old fish shop days on the hamburgers. Yeah. And the griller. Hey, folks. 
Yeah. Now seriously, if you're going to get one of these little spatulas and you're using it for plastering or rendering or, or mortar work, you're doing the wrong thing. It's the wrong purpose. This is used for cooking here. This is the stuff we do. We make our burgers. Careful. Like I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> what? What's wrong with you? You've broken everything. <laughs> I haven't broken anything. Look, okay, they're nice okay. and fluffy. Look okay. at that. I'm going to eat them. What do you think I'm it's going to look like? I'm going to put them in a lavira. And cut a lavira, burn yourself, put them straight away. It's good. It's a lavira. Five minutes will be all right. Let's see. Bam. Oh, Bubba. Oh. Bubba. Oh, yeah, let me up. Okay. I'm gonna get him hot, 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 hot. What? You cursed me again. <laughs> Jeez. It's, it's nice. It needs more, actually, a little bit more, folks. So this is good. This is watermelon. Yeah. Spoons dessert. Yeah. Just got to boil it, let it reduce a little bit, become a bit more syrupy, That's and it. it's ready to go. Yeah. Don't it's forget. Nice. You had some fun today. Yeah, of course. Fun. <laughs> yeah, ready I for bed. I got the dishwasher. Yeah. yeah, that's me. Actually, I got to go wash the dishes now. And don't forget, tomorrow morning we're doing an interview with Andrew Kennett, the science behind black grit and water bag, and how important it is to have it in your garden. Our website, thesilliesgarden.com, for all those wonderful specials. Check it all out, thesilliesgarden.com. Try the black grit. <laughs> Believe me, trust me, the best. <laughs> I love you, love. Maresi. Maresi too.